Hartha Canute was King of Denmark from 1035 to 1042, King of the English from 1040 to 1042, and was the last Danish King of England. Hartha Canute was born around 1018 to Canute the Great and Emma of Normandy. Hartha Canute spent much of his childhood in Denmark, as had been arranged by his father. He was made Crown Prince of Denmark as a child, with Ulf Jarl, the husband of his aunt, as his regent. By the time Hartha Canute was ten years old, his father had already claimed Norway. In 1035, King Canute died, and Hartha Canute succeeded him as King of Denmark. He was supposed to succeed as King of England as well. However, he faced unrest in Denmark and Norway, as Magnus I had taken the Norwegian throne. So Hartha Canute focused his attention on Denmark and Norway. Meanwhile, in England, Harald Harefoot, a son of Canute by his first wife, took the English throne and was proclaimed king. Hartha Canute's mother attempted to maintain power in Wessex for Hartha Canute. In order to stabilise his grip on power, Harald ordered Earl Godwin to assassinate Alfred and Edward, the half-brothers of Hartha Canute. Earl Godwin killed Alfred and Edward narrowly escaped his fate and fled back to Normandy. Emma fled and met Hartha Canute, who sailed to arrange a strategy with her. However, this was not necessary as Harold died from illness in 1040. Hartha Canute arrived in England with his mother in June 1040 with 60 warships in case he was met with resistance. As soon as he was proclaimed king, Hartha Canute sought revenge for the murder of his half-brother Alfred. He had Harold's body disinterred and beheaded. The corpse was thrown into the River Thames before being retrieved and buried in a churchyard. Godwin was arrested and put on trial. However, he evaded punishment by offering a ship to Hartha Canute. Hartha Canute now focused on doubling the English fleet to deal with outside threats posed to England and Denmark. To fund this, he increased taxes, which led to resentment from the English. Hartha Canute's way of ruling also made things worse. Usually the king ruled with a council of advisers. Hartha Canute did away with the council and ruled on his own, making decisions as he saw fit. He intimidated those around him to enforce his rule. As you might expect, the people were not happy. Eventually they had enough and in 1041 some tax collectors were murdered. Hartha Canute's way of handling the situation proved unpopular. He ordered the town that had murdered the tax collectors burned down and all of its civilians killed. Many of the residents fled once word of the punishment reached them. Although the town was burnt and plundered, the civilian casualties were low. Though Hartha Canute's reign was only two years, for the English it was two years too many. He died on the 8th of June 1042 from a suspected stroke. He was the last Danish king to rule over England.